tags, or they're essentially cattle ear tags. They're a, a typical method that a lot of research groups use to identify their individuals. So essentially like the turtle getting an earring. No pet tag. So here I'm just cleaning the area that I'm going to insert the pit tag into. Essentially each pit tag, which is a passive integrated transponder, uh, has a unique barcode um, for each animal that it's inserted into. And then this needle contains the pit tag. It's about the size of a grain of rice. And what that pit tag will do is it'll stay with her throughout her, his or her entire life um, and be uh, used by us or another researcher that has a pit tag scanner um, to scan the animal and identify that barcode. So these will give you a much better recapture history um, 20 to 30 years down the road, whereas flipper tags are pretty good for maybe 10 years. 65.2. 65.2 over barnacle? For like 61.2. 61.2 for, for, for width, 60.2 for minimum. Okay. 61.7. For what? For straight line. 61.7? Yeah. Got it. 48.8 for width. 48.8? Yeah. Got it. 13.1 for head. 13.1 for head. So right now I'm going to swab the area right around the dorsal cervical sinus if she would cooperate. Thirty-five point one kilograms. Okay. Got it. Oh, well. That's ripping. Can you grab the? Can you grab the? Uh, we put it. Yeah. yeah. Or, yeah.